Well, I love a spot of shopping and I'm down here at Drum and Golf and I'm in the market for a buggy and I've got Jackie here to help me out. Now, Jackie, what do customers look for in a buggy? Oh, Brie, there's so many different types of buggies on the market now and you, you can spend anywhere up to, I don't know, $500 on a buggy, but doesn't mean you can't buy this little monster. So easy to use, folds up, straight in the car. And what's so great about it is a lot of people will leave their bag on here because as you said, it can go straight in the car, but this one doesn't have a third wheel. No. And I understand you can't put an umbrella on it because it might topple over a little bit. That's right. So if you try to put an umbrella holder on this buggy, as soon as you lift that up to go, the umbrella hits you in the head. Yeah. So you really need a third wheel yes. buggy if yeah. you want to put an umbrella holder on it. This over here, this is a third wheel buggy, a bit more of a fancy model. Yeah. And what I love about it is it's got so many compartments, so many features, and it has a swivel wheel. Yeah, and the good thing about the swivel wheel is if you don't want to use it as a swivel, you can lock it in. So if you're playing at a hilly golf course, and you need to, and the lay of the land is taking the buggy down, yes. you can lock the wheel in and just head straight back up the hill. That's great. And there's lots of accessories you can add to this, like a seat, and there's so many other options as well, yeah. which is pretty cool. But there's a lot of options that come with the buggy. So you have an umbrella holder that can go straight on like that. You've got a sand bucket loop there. We've got a drink holder. We've got a pouch here to put all your balls and teas. Yeah, great. And it folds down really well. And that's that's one thing, because how many times do you get in the car park and you see people battling with their yeah. buggies? Well, this is super easy. So you let that handle go. Yeah. You put your foot there. So one click. Push there. Two clicks. And straight under. Three clicks. Three and look clicks. how compact it is. Back we go. Fit that in the back of the Genesis. So light. And then we move on to the big dog. This yeah. is pretty fancy, isn't uh, it? These navigator buggies are so good. They full remote control. Yeah. So pull that out. Easy to use. Uh, turns on a dime. Wow. Less strain on your shoulders because you're not pushing anything. Yes. Yeah. And when these first came out, I remember they had the big motors and they were quite difficult to... But look how compact this is now and it's just a battery. Yeah. And when you finished your game, one click, battery's off, you charge that back in the car, ready to go for the following week. But the other cool thing is they're just as small as these. So these wheels invert. Right. Pull this around like that. Oh, that's pretty neat. Go like this. And straight down, a bit like those other buggies there. Do you know what, Jackie? I've just learnt something. <laughs> There you go. Amazing. Well, there's plenty of options here mm. from depending on what you want. And I think we might have found an option for you.